In today's video, I will teach you how to use the scissor stool in GIMP. Let's get started. Start by opening the image that you want to work on in GIMP. You can do this by going to the File menu, then select Open, then navigate to your image file. Now, select the scissors tool, which you can find in the toolbox, or use the shortcut key I. Begin by clicking on the edge of the shape that you want to select. This initial click serves as the starting point. Then proceed to click at regular intervals along the perimeter of the shape making sure to follow its contours. The more accurately you trace the shape, the better your selection will be. And once you've clicked around the entire shape, it's time to finalize your selection. Before doing so, you may want to adjust some points in the scissors tool dialog. For example, you can enable feather edges to create a smooth selection boundary. To choose the selection, click on the first point that you made. This will connect the last point you clicked to the first one. And after closing the loop, click inside the perimeter of the shape. This action converts your clicks into selection. And now that you've made your selection, you can use it for various purposes. For instance, you can copy and paste it onto another page, applying filters or adjustments to it, or delete the selected area. Experiment with different tools and options to achieve the desired effect. Remember, practice makes perfect. Don't worry if your first attempts aren't perfect. With practice, you'll become more proficient at using the scissors tool to make accurate selections in GIMP. Enjoy exploring and creating with your newfound skill. If you find this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And if you want to see more tutorials, turn on the notification bell to get notified whenever we upload new videos.